Hello, everyone at home, and welcome to Rhythm Cafe here on the Mighty Loading Ready Run Video Entertainment Network, which is not really a network, it's kind of that one place, but I'm going to try plugging the, the, the cord in. We've had an afternoon, folks. We have had an afternoon of, uh, of, of trying to uh, get this particular game up and running and ready to go, and... How does anyone use this system? God. I mean, I know I have a PS4, and yeah. I know how to use it. What the heck? Well, I mean, when, when you put that kind of a theme on, which I agree is is is, is bright and, and beautiful and bold and, and, and out there, it's not easy to navigate. <laughs> ah, there we go. Okay, good. Uh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to swap an uh, Ethernet cord in there. How, how, how have you been doing, Heather? Uh, let's see. I spent a long time doing data entry to get today, and we all know what that kind of feel is. Staring at a computer with many letters and numbers in your eyes and being like, wait, what date was that thing? Wait, was that... Did I get the right episode number? I don't know. Meh. So now I'm going to stare at a different computer screen while we play a rhythm game, but I don't have to think about the things I'm writing down, so... I guess there's that going for it. I don't... Uh, I also discovered that, that the... Uh, we rediscovered that the PlayStation 4 uh, console itself is much like a cat belly. That if you touch it in exactly the wrong places, it makes angry noises and then sometimes turns off. Mm. Uh, done with that, thank Depending you. Depending on what, what number you push. Oh, right, yes. Okay. Do you... you got the... the yeah, other yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's not that important, but... Uh, if you find it... Yeah, I'll uh, let you know. That would be great. We've had, yeah, like I said, we've, uh, we've, we've had a uh, we've, we've had a, an afternoon. There are, what you said, three PlayStation 4s in the office right now? There are right three now? PlayStation 4s in the office at this very moment, and Paul isn't even here. He's probably somewhere else with the fourth one. That that must um, be it. Yeah, the, there's, there's, you, you, you brought yours in yep, yep. for tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Yes, we um, need a uh, little tiny uh, Kelsey Grammer. Yep, yep, and, uh. I think the other one. I'm assuming the other one is 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 Adams. Mm -hmm. I'm guessing uh, for Bloodborne. Well, probably Bloodborne, yeah. maybe, or something. I think it's Adams though. Uh, and then and then the office one. Yeah, so which we is the up, one that we're on right now. We booted up the office one, and that was all good. And it said Needed hi. Needed to be updated. Please, please you know, connect yeah. me with with actual. I I can't reach the internet. Give me data on a, on a USB stick, like an animal. Yeah. And we got that done. Yeah, we did that. Uh, and, and then we had to download the game. Mm -hmm. We had to figure out how to log in. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I don't know. Just, there seemed like there were a lot more steps involved in, in starting today there, there than I was were. anticipating. And we got here early. We started on this early <laughs> in anticipation of this being an issue. Uh, yeah. Hey, remember No Straight Roads? That... Yeah, I do. Actually, you know what? We should just probably bring up the screen here uh, and, and look at the, those together because... <laughs> there are a lot of games. There's a lot of mem we've, memory. We've definitely been the ones using this PlayStation right? 4, this particular PlayStation 4. Uh, okay, right doesn't work. When for, I push right or left, it doesn't. For, uh, for, for some time, I think. Because mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. you can tell uh, the game we're downloading, mm -hmm. Persona 5. Dancing in Starlight. Yes. Yep. Uh, no straight roads. No straight roads. Um, Okay, that's, that, that's, that's all on that's, you. That's, that's, that's on you. That, no, that one's Adam. That, oh, oh, oh that, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't stream that here. Um, this, this was all us, us though. Yep. Uh, I think that was Corey. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's definitely a Let's Know game. Yep. That's definitely Adam. Who's this? Is this you? Fun fact: No, that Ooh. was actually Corey back on a New Day Tuesday or something along that Ooh. lines. Who did Faye? Uh, is that is that a let's know? I believe it's pronounced iron. Hi, iron. No, oh, I'm, I'm sorry. sorry. I'm making a really bad joke. There. I know what joke you're making. That's why I'm not laughing. Sorry about waiting for you to put liquid in your mouth. No, for that's that. all right. Sarah uh, says that that was Paul who played. The, oh, that makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. Kate, Kate, I need someone to yeah, like. This is the PlayStation Now logo, oh. right? It's a guitar pick, right? Yes. Why is it a guitar pick? <laughs> Don't know. It was, that, that was during that, that weird time when people were thinking, let's make icons, shapes, inside of squares. I don't know who this one was. Mm, Darks, Dark Siders. Siders. That, that sounds like an atom. It, that sounds like an atom. Mm -hmm. 
but I'm also willing to just kind of attribute anything to Adam mm -hmm. if I don't know for sure. We're going to be talking here for a while. We are going to be talking here for this a while. This is so slow. We Sh have better internet than Should this. we just jam on some... <laughs> I'm afraid if we start anything up, this will get slower. It's a good point. I even plugged... I don't, does computer still work that way? I, I believe so. I, I plugged directly into the uh, into the Ethernet too, so this should be be sucking down a lot faster than this. Chat. Fifteen minutes till game AMA. What do you want? Yeah. We're here. We'll pretend that we're Rhythm Cafe. <laughs> Ooh, actually, yeah. Let's. Uh, while we're doing that. I'll make sure we are Rhythm Cafe. Oh no. I don't know what that means. <laughs> means we're just gonna get some slow acoustic bass while we I see. play Let's for the game. see. Uh Eric the Orange just asked, how do I like tunic? I loved it. I streamed it, actually. He is just breaking things now. Oh no, it's it's not breaking, it's just the Morocco fell off. <laughs> Rocket just hanging out. Oh, I see. Excuse me. Yeah. Oh wow, that's a 4D database Maraca from MacWorld 2000. Oh man, that's a weird. little weird show and tell going on. Uh, Ian, you tell me about what anime you're watching. I'm watching a little show called Lupin the Third. Was that the show that comes one? Yes, that was. Uh. I haven't watched any further episodes since we watched the Sherlock Holmes episode. Oh, which... is there another one after the Sherlock Holmes one? Oh yeah, no. This I, when I say I'm watching Lupin the Third, I'm watching Lupin the Third Part Two, Ooh. the uh, the the 1980s uh, ridiculous series. What color jacket? Uh, red. red. That's the red jacket. Red jacket. Uh, red jacket's but, good. Yeah. Uh, finished up uh, the old uh, ranking of kings and. You know, if, if we're going to talk about uh, Beach's anime roundup in our... In we our... might as well hijack. He, he can't be here until, like, 9, yeah, I think no. is what it is. Just, we might as well hijack the anime roundup stream. Well, we can also talk about our picks for... Uh, for our picks for Beach's anime roundup rather than our picks for anime. What's he going to pick? <sighs> okay. Uh, let me see if I can remember what, what I've seen on this. Because I haven't been watching any, any anime. But I know when he brings up the Plex server, I know what some of the artwork looks like. So... Uh, I know he's been he's been watching Ranking of Kings. I know that one for sure. Uh, something with I don't think this is his pick because he seemed annoyed by it, but he still was watching it. Something that had a wolf girl in it, except it's not a wolf girl. They just look like a wolf girl, and they're they're the brain of a boy who's been put into a wolf girl. And there's a bunch of monsters, and he's very upset about having to be a wolf girl. And everyone else just keeps saying that they look cute. So they should put up with it, I hmm. guess. So there's that one. Mm -hmm. There's always something about some guy being brought in is, is as an Izakai, and now he's running the kingdom or something and making it better. Mm -hmm. I think in that particular one, they were going to just... The country was just going to give him to the other country because they owed that country taxes and then he was just like how about you don't and i just i help you uh, not owe them money without it being my life so there's there was like that mm -hmm. uh, let's see what else did i finish they all kind of start to look the same they after really a while. do is he watching the non-communicational uh or is that, that, that coming this next season? I think that one might be later. Okay. I know I know there's another like uh uh something of a bookworm oh. is continuing. Mm -hmm. Uh and I liked that one, or at least the parts I watched of it. So that's kinda cool. Uh, uh, t Tiger and Bunny? That's coming Tiger later. Tiger and this... Bunny is getting more, though, right? Later this year, in fact. Season 2. They've just announced it today. Or Series 2, I guess you could say. Yeah, see, I'm, I'm, I'm willing to come back to anime for that. <laughs> I liked Tiger and Bunny. I liked watching, uh, uh, what's her name? Pepsi Girl. <laughs> I can't remember what her name was. I just remember the branding. Uh, the Volley Boys have not come back. I mean, there there have been a few volleyball series. I I, I dipped into a badminton series this year called uh, Riemann's Club, which is a weird portmanteau of the word club and the back half of Salary Man. 
or the middle part of Salary Man. Uh, and it's it's about a guy who uh, joins a company or is recruited to a company to be, I guess, a amateur badminton player for the company team. Okay. And does badly at like the sales stuff involved. Oh, but but they 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 want him because they want to do better in the company sports. Stuff. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. And you looked into that series specifically because the voice actor for Kazuma Kiryu of the Yakuza series of games, of which I am a well-known fan was the voice of the coach. Just doing his Kazuma Kiryu voice, too, which was beautiful. Uh, we got some information about the uh, the Witch from Mercury, too. The new Gundam series. The first Gundam series uh -huh. with a female protagonist, too. Which is gonna they be haven't done that before? No, they have not done that. For f and and it might and they might skirt up because this is Gundam. Okay. Are you checking the year? I was trying to, but then I realized my watch doesn't actually show the year. It just shows the month and the day, and I I got, I don't know. Forty years, Heather. That series has been going. I mean, it's twenty twenty two. I just you know I I can understand it being like oh it's been like thirty years and we haven't done whatever and like I you know you hit the two thousands maybe. Something. Mm -hmm. So we don't know if, she, if, she, if the character they showed off is the titular witch from Mercury, but we do know that she, she is extant and that she is standing in front of a new Gundam that looks kind of interesting. It's got big, thick thighs, small, uh, small calves, and little tiny feet. So uh, gotta have those thunder thighs. There are some people in the Gundam community who are very excited for the return of big thighs, and it's been it's been big calves for decades now. It's been the thing. And now, you know, bringing it back to these these, these tapering legs to it. Not quite a, uh, not quite a point yet, but uh, if we get the uh, advance of Zeta, we'll get there, hopefully. Yeah. What else have I been watching? Not much. I'm on season seven of Castle. Because <laughs> that's the show I've been watching. Mm-hmm. Now, is that one of the ones that's directed by Jonathan Frakes? I don't know. Okay. It's uh, Nathan Fillion is a writer who trails around a police officer. Writer and police. Right. Okay. I'm thinking of Leverage, which is which, a different kind honestly, of Honestly, I, I feel like as as far as like police procedural shows go, because I'm not totally into the style of them all the time, but the idea of this combination of like, there's a murder, there's a mystery, and we solve the mystery by basically being like, oh, well... This person got murdered. Let's spend a long time figuring out what who they were as a person. And I'm like, yeah, okay, I can get behind that. Also, they make some Firefly references in there that just make me laugh. Ah, uh, profile. But they, refu and... they refuse to say Firefly out loud. I mean, as time goes on, that's probably a better and better decision. So uh, that's been pretty good. I think actually, what I, I could use is just a little bit of help uh, deciding what I am going to watch next. Uh, because I have finished Mobile Suit Gundam, the original 1970s series. Okay. And I've been trying to work my way through older series that I have set up. Uh, so I'm thinking either it's going to be the next Tomino series from 1984, uh, L Game, which is a, uh, a another real robot spacey show. Uh, but I also have not seen Future Boy Conan yet, mm. which is another uh, issue. But also, Brain Powered... Again, by Tomino, but uh, from later on, and featuring the work of uh, Maya Sakamoto in the theme song. Uh, that's a show I didn't give enough time to back in the uh, the old times. Oh, so you 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 kind of tried before, but you didn't. Yeah, this was back in through? this was back in Anime Club. We watched one episode of it, and made fun of it, and, and decided, no, we're not going to do this. And... I I think I think that would be a really interesting one to go for next thing, because I mean, it, it's got the music, yeah, bent and and. If you know you've kind of seen part of it already, why why not just go? Yeah, it might be nice to that. figure out what the heck's actually going on. No, the Tatami tanks were Himiko Den. That's right. I, that's a that was an actual bad series. Uh, Pat Labor was recommended in the chat, uh, but I don't like Pat Labor. It's a good show. It's not a, that it's a bad show. I just don't like it. It's not my style of show. You don't have to like Pat Labor. It's actually he's it's, just really into Pat Labor, so not, he's always wanting to watch it. And oh I'm like, yeah. yeah, no, I'm not watching that with you. No, it's absolutely not for you. It is for middle-aged smoking men in like middle management. It's that's who it's made for. So I it's tried, not surprising. I thought I would like Pat Labor because mm -hmm. I really like um, oh what what's that what's that '80s show? 
uh, Bubblegum Crisis. Yeah. The original. Which is, again... Not, not the remake. <laughs> I like the remake just fine, but it's I really like the uh, I really like the way Pris looks in the original. Mm-hmm. And I was just like, oh, robot suits. Those are cool. Mm-hmm. Sure, Pat Labor. Nah. So in, uh, in Destiny, we're currently uh, doing a, a poll to decide what the Halloween costumes are going to be in-game this year. And they're trying to decide between robots and uh, and monsters, or robots and dinosaurs. And the robot suits, one of them looks almost exactly like a Gundam. The other, or the, uh, uh, the, 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 the wizard ones, looks almost exactly like a bubblegum crisis hard suit. It's beautiful. Ooh. See, that's what I really liked about Bubblegum Crisis, and like you, you, you put on these really neat power suits that uh-huh. no way a human being can fit in that would actually work that way, but they they look amazing. Mm-hmm. A lot of spandex in, in that that time frame. Okay, yeah, I, I think I will I, I will hit up uh, brain powered, especially because just this past week, twenty years later, we're finally getting some good merchandise for the show, in the form of uh, some good figurines of the uh, models. So that'll be fun. Uh, I also recall I don't it might have been in it might have been in the remake of Bubblegum Crisis, but I recall the scene where because uh, they 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 uh, a bunch of them one of them works like just kind of a standard office job, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and so she's playing superhero, and one of her uh, office colleagues this, this this man with a very eighties style suit on tells her that she shouldn't work out so much because guys don't like muscly girls and there's just like this look on her face it's like oh i'll show you what my thighs can do wow <laughs> break your neck is what wow. they can do that's that's nene isn't it i think so yeah do, uh, believe it or not i may not have actually seen bubblegum crisis it might just be one it's of very those... short oh good the, good the original one's like eight episodes i think it might be one of those shows that just kind of snuck by and i've learned enough about it to be able to talk about it Hey, guess what? We're playing a game here on Rhythm Cafe. Yay! It's called Sound Shapes, which is... Easy games. That's, that's not a good start. That's... I'm a little not sure about that. Okay. Uh, which one's my... I need to turn that down. In my ears. Oh, wow. All right. All right. It's about playing and creating... And cr- creating music. Okay. Move. Okay, good, Move. good. Did we come out of the bath? Does the bath have a plug next to it? I, <laughs> that's a bad, not a good bath then. Maybe we're maybe we're a soap bubble Ooh. that uh, hasn't learned to float. Mm, that that would make sense because the other option is that we're a really shitty fried egg. Yeah, I was also gonna say we don't look great as an egg. <laughs> Mm. Oh. oh, it's kind of one of these type of platformers. So it's like if Mario was actually, you know, paying artists for music rather than just uh, expecting them to sing for him. I wish the world had caution signs like this for me. Red uh, things hurt you. Yeah. Whew. Right, including those ones. Right, red things. I don't know, I saw the moving one and I'm like, oh yeah, that'll hurt me. I'll just use this as a platform to jump onto the next platform. No, don't do that. That one's smoking. Oh, hey, we're becoming a less shitty egg. I mean, we're kind of green now, so maybe yeah. don't eat us. But definitely what? Dr. Seuss yeah, we could go hang out with Ham. He's a doctor. Dr. Ham. I'm a ball and move faster. Oh, Ooh. good. No! Yes, I know I can jump further when I'm involved, but <laughs> guess what I didn't do? That might not be a, a description, that might just be a command. Whee! No! I'm on it! Back! No! Oh, no! Does it count? Do I get no? Well, game's over. You stick to, but not when you're a ball. Okay, so very so Metroid only, so far. Only when you're an egg yolk. Your ball, no sticky. You know what this means? 
Actually, I'm not sure what this, what this means. We're ceiling gag. Ah! Everything I've ever wanted. Just just to know Some, what's... Someone finally made a ceiling egg game. Just to know what ceiling egg is feeling when... And we're in the room. How do you feel? Seal... No, wait. Ceiling, feeling... Egg... Nope. Just gonna back down from what I was trying to do. Do. You're on the ceiling. We just want to know your feeling. Ceiling egg goes on adventure. In ball mode, you are not sticky. about this game like a normal platformer and not the puzzle platformer that it is. Now try this. I'm glad that you're in default sticky mode. in my ears. You can have jam in your ears, but you gotta make sure it's not the sticky jam. It's <laughs> true. Because you don't want sticky jam in your ears. This is the goal. Yeah, okay, but <laughs> I, I was robbed. Yeah, you were. Oh, that one. <laughs> <laughs> Let's try making a song. Okay. When I make a new level, we'll start like this. Oh, it's a turntable, not a bath. Oh, okay, I see it now. Lots yes. Of place notes in the world. I thought it was a bath with a railing and a, a plug, you know, so that you can uh, listen to the radio and have a terrible. Make it some toast. Yeah. Nothing, there's nothing, nothing better than, the, than some good Look, if you're gonna toast. be sticky by eating jam on toast, you might as well be taking a bath while you do it. Terrain. Okay. Ah, oh, there's the cursor. Switch one probably didn't take off as much. I think it well. 
It's not red, it shouldn't hurt you. Good point. I mean, the tutorial hasn't told us about blue objects yet. I won! Mario Maker was 2015, this was 2012. Really? Neat. Okay, well. Good for them. I mean, we, we probably have to go all the way back to something like a uh, little big planet if we're going to talk about. Uh, oh, that's le true. Style that's true. It had, it had a lot of that going on, didn't it? It was big for that, wasn't it? Yeah, people really wanted that. I heard a lot of good things about Little Big Planet. I didn't. I didn't own any consoles that at the time to play that kind of thing. Um, but I, I did like the character because, you know, knitted thing. Yeah. It, it knitted being. It was a it giant was zipper on the very front. Very crafty. Cute. Oh, I get to touch these too. Have I? We've played a lot of games on this it's, it's not a rhythm game. No, it's, no. Uh, um, I've played the PS4 version, but the it was very much made with the Vita in mind. Uh, it's one of those games that there's a character who's around there, but you're playing God and you're actually trying to help the character move around. Interesting. So, just, uh, you're doing things like shining a flashlight at them and like trying to help them uh, deliver mail, essentially. Very. It's it's very. It's got a craft aesthetic to it, but it's also just very cute. It's not nice. Oh god. <laughs> Nothing else about this is nice. <laughs> about which button is the note button. Okay. <laughs> We're on your happy controller now. I know, but the... The West is a problem. I know, I know. Fine again, wait. No. I just want to play the game. <laughs> just want to play your game. This game has not been doing, treating us very well, Heather. Very dangerous. I'm pretty sure I've actually used that technique while uh, while swimming at some point. Landing landing on a frog and then like. Oh no, the breathing technique. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh. this scared of a world since I like turned on Breath of the Wild. <laughs> so many things that want to hurt you.
Oh, no, I can go down there. <laughs> Down's not usually a good option in games. <laughs> yeah. Also, the spiky areas. They're, kinda, ups they're upsetting, uh, the spikies, aren't they? Getting, uh, getting real Mega Man vibes from us. Here in my video games. Good, good. You can stick to spider. Spider friend will take you where you want to go. Well, they're probably male friend spiders anyway. Oh no. You're gonna do what I exactly think you're gonna do, aren't you? Or not. Okay, sure. Stick you all? Yeah! I thought the little arrows were gonna make the level tilt. Oh. That was my that was my biggest concern. Okay. People are things we can also stick to. Good to know. Is this is this a surprise in the year where we see the release of Cling Together? You make a good point. I, I don't I don't think I can argue that. What if that game's just about sticking to each other? Oh! Bounced, bounced in the wrong way. I like this one. Mm -hmm. I like this sound. I wish my breathing sounded like that. It's the kind of pet I would enjoy at home. little volcano frogs. Oh. No! Can't, can't pop on the same frog. No double bouncing. Here. Wonder if the things on at the top of the screen mean anything. Let's never find out. Yeah, this is probably not that important.
that. Okay. Oof. My turn is over. You found a way out of here. Hmm. Music by a proud robot. Robots should be proud. Yes. Okay. Cool. Sneak I mean, and deek. Let's let us deek some sneak. run at it and run over it like jump over right Th yes good i was <laughs> i can't touch that stuff <laughs> the blue stuff makes me feel bad you know, my favorite line in ghostbusters blue stuff makes me feel bad Whee. you know it's it's the opposite of a stealth section right it's the ah! runaway very fast section that's generally how I do my self stealth sections. Ah! Oh, well, then, then you'll be great at this. Oh, God. Wait, I come back from there. Okay, you, you can see me. Vines since Donkey Kong math. Sorry, Donkey did, Kong Jr. math. Did, did you have to solve math in order to get to the other vine? Yeah, you did actually. But going, you know, going down from the bottom and looping around the, the vine is the worst part of this. <laughs> well, you know, flatline rules. <sighs> No! Over here! Yes! Follow me! Ow! No! I had a plan! No! My plan! <laughs> is still in effect. Oh no! Oh yeah! Keep going! Ah! Ah! And now I can leave! Oh great! <sighs> that was uh... Well, you know, there's still more terrifying level to happen. <laughs> no, 
you can still see me. <laughs> That's not gonna help. I think your best bet might be to just jump down and then jump over. Okay, well, we can do that, yeah. Actually, we want to take a quick break. I'm cool if you want to just skip it today. Let's just skip the break. Uh, just gonna start we here. had so much trouble starting. We did. We and did. I feel like if we take a break, we break something. Yeah, mm, good point, good point. Right in the dog, man. Hey. See the signs? Oh, yeah, yeah. Heather, stop using the stick. <laughs> oh, we can stop using the stick? You don't have to use the stick, you can use the D-pad. Oh, thank god. Uh, I keep forgetting and reverting, but uh, I prefer D-pads for platformers. Mm-hmm. Precision? Much? Okay. I'm not sure how I feel about the life cycle of these missile doggies. have a short life cycle. Two, um, three, four, five. I would like to live more than six seconds most days. <laughs> well, you're not a rocket dog. Mm -hmm. So I think you'll be okay. You can tell because I'm 40 years old. About six seconds. Oh, this is gorgeous. going on in the screen. Yep. Uh, mm. 
missile axolotls or miss axolotls. I I could go for being a miss axolotl. need more axolotl based games. dog face the size of an apartment building just coming down towards you. I feel like uh, you're describing a scene from like Paprika <laughs> or something. Thank you. I anytime anyone's willing to compare me to Satoshi Kon, I am I will take that <laughs> as the compliment it is. Music Dead by Deadmaus. Right, Deadmaus. I forget that's how it's actually pronounced. Heather, there are some good titles. I want to go play the Beck album. The Go Back the Beck album. <sighs> Who knows how long we'll get to play this game? It's a good point. I mean, at least another 50 ish minutes. 50 ish. 50 ish. Yes. Ooh. Oh, I'm you a. Are a giant egg compared to these buildings. I am extremely excited to find out how this is going to break all the sex laws. Sex laws was the name of an egg song. Ah, okay. <laughs> like, I only watched the anime, and I don't even know if that's the same group. Yeah, I'm, I'm also beginning to question, did you watch the anime Beck Mongolian, Beck colon Mongolian Chop Squad in America? Or did you watch Futurama, the episode that had Beck? What happens in the Futurama episode that has Beck? Um... He and Bender interact? Okay, those missiles will hook me. Yeah, they probably will. I mean, you should, just, you should really just assume missiles are gonna hurt you. Go right into them. Although I do kind of... I mean, I don't really think I, I want any kind of missile to exist, but at the same time, I would be tempted to see what one that can move like that is like, wait, I'll just say... Run! Ah! <laughs> yeah, good, it gets the feeling across. Uh... Huh. It's the one where Bender does a concert for broken robots. Right! Okay, yes. no, I do remember that episode, but I... Uh, remembering celebrities and stuff is not a thing I, I do well. I, I concur. There's a reason there's a joke about Ian cannot remember the, the faces of celebrities. 
I constantly, when I talk, when, when Beach talks about movies, he'll oh name like every actor in the movie, which is really cool. But I'm just like, I don't know who you're talking about. Tell me the character names. That's what I watch. Yeah. The point of an actor is to be able to disappear into their shit. <laughs> I mean, I, I stand by that statement as well. The purpose of an actor is to disappear into their shit. Ah! <laughs> you need to really gun this. That's right, that's my problem, is I keep trying to make myself go fast. And that does not work. Uh... Where is the out hole? There it is. There. In the I was gonna say, if you if you go backwards oh God. to get to the top of the cloud, you could've probably... Okay, I need to ride the out of here. drive you up to the, yeah. the danger up the Favorite version of a disappearing platform. Lyrics written by cockatoos. What? Ah! Oh, don't! Don't! <laughs> you told me! You no, told that, me not to do that, that game, but I did it anyway. I mean, probably don't go near Luz either. Just a little. Okay, then, then it's gonna hurt. Yep.
better to try to land on the pipe. I think you're right. But... Uh, I just wanted to be cool for once. I... I... You, you gotta try and take the shot, right? Because yeah. you never know. Okay. No, it's not okay. Yeah, that was evidenced by the, the length oh of the goodness. level. You know what I like, though? The music? Well, I mean, yes. You died several times, yes. right? Oh, yes. You're, I, not, you're not getting penalized for that at all. That's a good point. It's just all about time. It's just about can you get them, can you make yes. the time? Like, wow, how, how, how are you doing? the people. Well, you did say people wanted to touch earlier. True. Things are dangerous. Ooh. Hello, Diamond Realm. That's where the 
Hast du Bremsling? That could have not have been out of place in the Steven Universe soundtrack. Oh yeah, we're gonna see them a lot, I think. Sun got a gun. Angry sun. This guy is also a member of the assassination plan. gonna happen a lot now. So far, I'm surprised that this game doesn't have a Toho album. Yeah, no joke. Which is significant, because that's pretty much all we do here. Lies are just the jokes that everyone likes. Like, jokes are just the lies that everyone likes. That's the way it goes. Yeah, 
keep how games like Owen Dunn were hard to keep track of. Uh. This has that beat. No! It's reached its final form! <laughs> Are these angry babies gonna do something? Okay, good. Whew. Ah, they're just bouncy. much people touching. So much going on for your eyes to keep track of. And look, we get all these horrific things in the editor now. I like Pyramid Man. The birthing gnome. Mm. I'm not sure about the other ones. They were not friendly. Well, I don't think birthing man's uh, that children were very friendly either, but... Hey, that's that's it's fine. Oh, uh, thank you. We've uh, found all the boxes we didn't unpack in the attic. Hello, friend. Oh. than what I thought they were going to give you. Yep. Launch! Oh, we are very egg. It's, um... It's, uh, what's her face's father? Yeah, Chiu. Chiu Chiu's father. He appears to have lost weight, too. <laughs> Come back. Take me to home. Ah, okay, ah, aha. 
Aha! I can escape by hitting X. based on color but every time I see spiky things I'm yep. like I, I, I shouldn't touch that at all D danger zone <laughs> Mouth squid. Not squid with a mouth, that's terrifying. Boy. This scene right here would make a great um, screensaver. Yeah. And it did die. animated kolachi up top. Good, good. Not 
You put the egg in the middle of toast. It's, uh, was it a toad in a hole? You got it! Toad hole. Why exactly? It's, the egg is not a toad. I'm gonna have to say something to do with the wind in the willows, which explains like half of British things. I think. I can see it. I'm gonna go see if there is an options menu because I'm curious about. Oh, the right green. Uh, there, if there is a. Yeah. Uh. Colorblind. Cloud sync. Reset your progress. Delete everything. Credits. Well, that's a little disappointing. Well, hmm. But I guess this game is from 2012. <laughs> so I can't go back in time and yell at them. I think that's it for the Beck. That's only three. Unless you wanted to play Cities again. <laughs> so I just hit Triangle. Triangle. New album. I'm going to go look at Pixels. Mm, the dead mouth. Dead mouth V. Well, their, their name shows up in like a, a bunch of rhythm games. They are a prolific artist. They're the one with the shiny mouse head, right? Yes, yes. Okay, yeah. cool. Not the not the game developer who wears a moon on his head or anything. No. Are they related? God, I. I mean, I know the answer to that's no, in like seriousness, but. It would be nice. I would like to see Yoko Taro working with more varied artists, though. We can get him and Ikuhara in the same room. Then we've got something going. Oh, God. Oh, I can't. Okay. I cannot. Yeah, all right. I can get behind these platforms. These are great. These are good platforms. They make a good ticky sound. Yeah, I would rate these uh, these characters as having a good mouth feel. Knob feel. Sorry, not mouth feel. Okay. I mean, I wasn't gonna say anything. Just make the face I was making. <laughs> about my actions. Oh no. Definitely not my actions then. It's good that you can stick the different sides of your friends. No! Friend, come back! No! Friend! I did the right thing. Okay. You ever think you did the wrong thing, you start to overcorrect, and then... Yeah. You mean the years 2008 through 2012? Ah! like a gear with the hole in the wrong place. Mm -hmm. I don't really associate it with my body.
do love that the spawn point just rotates you out of the level. <laughs> it's like going up and down between uh, rooms of Castlevania a million times. Nope. Oh wait. I don't know if this is better. Okay. Did it. Thankfully, our, our, our hitbox is deeper than our skin, so we can... I think uh, someone earlier called this musical Meat Boy. Well, I don't disagree, I've just never played Meat Boy, so my brain's just like, it's just Celeste. Uh -huh. Just be okay with that. Just meaty Celeste. that like uh make the wrong move thing one might say that they're both precision platforms to differing degrees i have you have locked the galaxies <laughs> <laughs> you just no i did this <laughs> Suspiciously close to Windows notification sounds. I was just troubleshooting a keyboard with PS2 issues earlier. My brain is so confused. I'm sorry, Kelderon. <laughs> oh. Nope. Honestly, after uh, every every stream I've had where where it decides to make the Windows noise, that's like you should update now. Um, I feel first just like, oh no, don't accidentally say yes, I'm streaming. And then I'm just like, oh, how many people did I trip up? <laughs> Default noises are the bane of everything. I don't need to touch them. You don't need to touch the spot. Yep. They don't count as the coins, apparently. Oh, that's beautiful. I mean, I try to turn, uh, I try to change most notification sounds I have into, into different notification sounds. Because a lot of TV shows will use the, yeah. the standard ones, so it's just kind of like, wait, what? Actually, there's, I don't know what I was watching, but, um... Uh, where where I live, we don't have like a, a bus box that that connects to cell phones. It's a uh, it's a system within. It, it, it has its own phone thing. To oh, let people it, in. it's got its own actual phone. Yeah. Um, Fine. Well, speaker thing. Yeah. Um, and it makes a really loud, horrific noise. And. Uh, when you're close to it, but it's, you know, that horrific, very far away sound. That when I'm in another room, I'm like, oh, I gotta, gotta go grab the door before they leave. There was something I was listening to that had a very similar sound oh, dear. playing, and I was just like, who the heck is here? It's like That's a left Oh! Oh! Oh, I mean, I guess you did at least hit the spawn point. Yeah. Right? <laughs> 
Uh, no, they're not. I guess they went back to their home. You might be able to go under and find them again, or... They went back to their home. I mean, I do that, too. I just go home after my friend's dish. Ah! Red laser beams. I don't see front lots can... Condition to be only be concerned about yellow laser beams. Oh! Ow! Damn it! No! My coins! Oh! You know what this game does really well, though? Uh, quick restarts? Yeah. Yeah. Like, the one fundamental thing you really need to have. Give me quick restarts or give me death. Because I'm going to be getting death a lot anyway. Aha! I figured out a hack. Ian uses the systems in the game called an hack. I suppose that's fair. I've heard that people keep talking about using the systems in a game of cheating, and I don't really get it. Uh, people have a, uh, a real love of being cheaters, or being perceived as cheaters. I don't know why, but... Probably because it makes them seem cool to other cheaters. You watch, uh, you, see, you saw the highlights, right? Yes. Yes, I did. I'm not playing Elden Ring, but I really liked watching that, that thing that Adam was fighting get stuck on the geometry. Oh yeah, that's that's super cool when that happens. My understanding is developers don't actually, the developers don't consider that to be hacking or cheating. That's just like... Uh, if, it's the thing that has happened. Yeah, if, if you can kill the enemy, by whatever means, it is valid. But as far as I'm concerned, cheese it. You yep. earned it. Yeah. Which is actually probably the most realistic way of gaming. If you can make it happen, then it is physically possible. So do it. That's how I. That's how I get angry too. I just, yeah, I just hey. do. Me. Me. No. Me. My name's Kai Shigen. I was worried that this vibrating style would mean something bad for me, but not! Be good! Actually, oh. we're, doing, we're doing quite excellent. Yeah, yeah, no, I'm, I'm happy with our progress in this game. Invadroids. Invadroid? De Rouge? Uh, more. Just a little egg coming out of the bathtub. Uh, oof, the bathtub. I don't know what bathtub is in French. Bane! Tub de Bane. I only know that because it's the title of one of my favorite Sheena Ringo songs. because this morning I made a Benedict, which generally is a good thing, but I absolutely ruined four poached eggs to the point where they just had to end up going down the sink, and I was, I oh. was apoplectic. And then, and then the pot, which was balanced on the side of the sink, which still had some of the hot water in it, 
decided that it was going to just tip off the sink and dump itself all over the kitchen floor, so that was fun, too. Aww. So eggs are a bit on Ian's shit list today. Oh. Oh, this is going to be a little on the rough side. Ah, right, you got this. You just got to let them... Yeah, there we go. Let them give their whole head shake. It's just the thing you do, right? You're like, yeah. ah, this will be hard, and then... No. Okay, go ahead, little thing. Just don't touch their mouth. Which is also, in my opinion, good advice in general. Good, you do kind of. This? This is bullying. It's still here, then they're coming back. curious about, or morbidly curious about the speedruns of this game. Oh, I would be too. And, oh yeah, I, I absolutely believe that this game is uh, well speedrun in the community. Shit often, but this. Okay, I can't. Oh ah, no! Run, run, no! You are not allowed to turn around. <laughs> I agree so much.
So I'm pretty sure the skeleton on the right is supposed to be a reference to Dead Mouse's mask, but it just looks to me like they attach two arms to the side of a person's hip bone. Yes. the robot of Nintendo, but Rob. Oh, I can't skip to that. At least you can't look up. I have good news. Their bodies block the shots. Sure. Oh, I know what I need to do. Okay. Uh, I need to go to the other side. youtube.com slash loading where you run. You can go to youtube.com slash loading where you live for all of the uh, VODs that we actually put up there. You can also check out youtube.com slash LRRPG for all of our magic content. Go to YouTube, no, go to loadingreadyrun.com slash live for a schedule of all the upcoming shows. I know that the we are coming up next with Is This Your Card? And then of course we'll probably have a play it forward on Monday and then in the evening of Monday we'll get crossing the stream with everybody's golf. really rough. It's fair. Uh, if you'd like to support us, we really appreciate all of you who do so, either by just hanging out in the chat, watching our videos, either on Twitch or on YouTube. Uh, we see you, YouTube. Uh, we also want to thank uh, those of you who are patrons over at patreon.com slash run. Those of you who are members of our YouTube community at youtube.com slash run. And of course, those of you who subscribe or drop hits here at twitch.tv slash Loading ready run. There are two of you, so I'll take care of that right now as well. I uh, we want to thank today Camille for 60 months of subscription. Thank you so much, Camille. And the Fickle Cat for 32 months. Ahoy hoy! What they say. 32 months, thank you so much, the Fickle Cat. Also, Earth One wants to please the beach, so they have mentioned yes. that 
you can buy things at store.oigreadyrun.com and that uh, you should. Because we still have things there. Yep. Last time I checked, which would have been, I don't know, sometime earlier today. I had a morbid curiosity. It's like, are we still alive? Great. Well, I know that Beach is not entered yet Odin the Beach. Wow. Entered the Beach sleep. So his work is still ongoing. And yes, his MTV's EDM points out. More money helps more people become full time. And if you want me to become full time, you're gonna have to give contribute a lot more because I got a government pension on the way. streaming here at Loading Ready Run. Uh, you can find me over at twitch.tv slash J playing a much more calm game. <laughs> Are you sure about that? Well, I'm playing Kirby's Epic Yarn right now, so yes. Okay, good. How about you? Uh, you can find me over at youtube.com. No, you can't. You can find me at tilty.house. That's tilty.house or tiltyhouse.com if you're stuck in the past. Um, I play Yakuza. Cory makes podcasts. We both have Twitter feeds. Check them out there. to the break noise. Uh, we probably will be coming back with more of this next week. So uh, get ready yep. for get that ready for, <laughs> for stress, Heather. Apparently, uh, screaming and <laughs> <laughs> there's just so much going on on that screen. Oh, it's... And it was like I I can see what I needed to do, and and I don't know. It just feels like I should have just been able to do it. It am a lot, but we got there. And uh, we got there at the beginning of the stream where we had to get there by downloading the game and then we played part of the game and we enjoyed it. We uh, we we didn't play anything for like, I think the first half hour. No, we didn't. We absolutely um, did not. But we did entertain you. And if you yes, like that. Yes, that's true. It's, that's... It's been a day, folks. We're going to go away. Uh, we was up next with this, this year card. See you next week for more sound shapes and uh, goodbye. <laughs>